Oh, we definitely got a special one today, man. The first footage, the first game of DJ Wagner and Rob Dillingham. Two top hoopers, man. DJ Wagner, you know he was top in Jersey and New Jersey. Top player in the country for his class. And then you had Rob Dillingham, who was playing for Overtime Elite. He was over there doing his thing too, killing the competition like crazy. He was unstoppable. Bro has an insane offensive game. And to see them two on the same court, man, you see these photos dropped. You see Rob there. You see DJ there. I'm going to be honest. It's just shocking to me to even see them both on the court at the same time because they're both so cold, bro. And I mean, you see the way Rob was dribbling up the court is so shifty. I think bro is trolling, it kind of looks like. But I mean, you, you see them here. And let's take a look at some of the footage because, all right, this is a practice. So let's take let's take a look at the actual game. So it looks like they ended up winning the, they won the game 81 to 73. And I mean, let's take a look at this. You see Rob, bro, the one thing that makes him so deadly is just, bro can dribble the ball. He has the ball on a string. It doesn't seem like he's losing it. Then you see DJ knocking down his shots. And it's like, how are teams going to be able to compete with that? Now, in my opinion, I think they both play D. At least I know DJ plays defense as well. I'm not so sure about Rob, how his defense is. But if these two guys really could put in work, man, it's going to be one of those crazy college seasons where you just see them killing on the court. Now, at the end of the day, it's not all about one-on-ones. And you got to be able to do more than just score. You know these teams are going to be double teaming them, really looking at them to try to stop their offensive game. But, bro, just look at the pull-up. It's looking way too easy out here for both of them. Like, I, I really like seeing both of the two play on the court, especially since they're just top-ranked players already. They know offensively their game, and they're aggressive, bro. They're doing exactly what they were doing in high school, attacking the hoop. So it's going to be interesting to see how they do actually play, you know, when they get to when they get to the actual when the college game starts. Now, some people are even wondering if these two dudes have a chance to be one and done. Personally, man, we got to wait until see till the season actually starts. But low-key, I don't think either of them are super, super tall. And you know the game of basketball is shifting towards more of taller players. But, I mean, you see, now we got some stats here. You see DJ Wagner. He had 16.7 of 15 from the field, 6 assists. And I think people forget also the type of pressure that are on these dudes. I mean, you remember, if you're a top-ranked player in the country and then you're coming to college, people have certain expectations that you're going to play pretty well. And, I mean, DJ, you see him here. All that talent on Kentucky just for them to be a second-round exit. Yeah, man. I mean, they always they do a pretty good job recruiting. But you see this year, easily the best freshman class this year. I'm telling you, DJ and having Rob on the same team is is... Ah, man, I'm not going to lie. It's it's just the type of it's just a different type of bag, man. I love the offense. Maxed out shot creator. I'm dead. Nah, I mean, you see Kentucky looking real nice without a center too. Bro, we just talking about two guards. I'm not even talking about a center. Man, we don't care about the big man. If they could get a nice big man, it it'd be wild. I, I don't really know the other players on their team like that. But yeah, you see bro here too. Says it. excited to see Rob and them boys this year. Bro got to be a top 10 pick. Bro, Rob's tough. I'm just worried about his height and how he plays. But he's played against taller players for a minute. So hopefully bro can get drafted. But yeah, bro, that bag is just, is just looking insane. People forget he was the number one recruit in high school. I'm telling you, DJ Wagner, people are sleeping on Kentucky overall. I'm going to keep it a buck, man. Bro, they're going to they're gonna do something big this year. Just watch and see. Now, if you do enjoy these types of videos, man, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit this next video on the screen because you won't want to miss it.